While the metaverse may still be in its infancy, Big Tech is investing billions of dollars into developing products and accessories for this potentially enormous market. Welcome, Slicers. Meet the top 10 players in the XR industry. One, Apple. Apple has been a pioneer in AR and VR and is known for creating new markets. Apple is now leading the charge in AR with its software development platforms and frameworks like AR Kit and Reality Kit and creative tools like Reality Composer and Reality Converter. In the headset arena, Apple has been teasing the release of its mixed reality headset for years now. Apple will be receiving components for the device's manufacturing early next year, and a possible product launch is predicted for late 2023. However, don't hold your breath. Past forecasts have proved wrong. Speculators and inside sources claim that the headset will be loaded with up to 15 cameras and an incredibly high resolution display. Some rumored features include advanced gaming capability, spatial recognition, and integration with Apple services like Apple TV, Apple Music, and Apple Arcade. Two, Dell. Look for Dell PCs with the Ready for VR badge to power your VR experience. Dell's expansive VR portfolio includes the world's first VR-enabled mobile device and an all-in-one mixed reality workstation. With Dell, you can expect high-performance standards and all the processing power you'll need for amazing XR experiences. Businesses will use Dell's professional VR to keep up with quicker times to market and shorter development cycles. Maintaining a competitive advantage in this current business environment depends on XR and AI technologies. Those who reject it will be left behind. 3. Sony Sony's next VR headset, PlayStation VR 2 for PS5, is available for pre-order and touts significant advancements in VR and mixed reality. Sadly, the headset is still tethered and requires a PlayStation console. However, visually, it offers a stunning 2000 by 2040 pixel resolution per eye, 120 hertz frame rate, 110 degree field of view, and eye tracking. The headset will mesh with your surroundings by scanning walls, floors, and obstacles like chairs and desks. The meshing is another step towards mixed reality for the consumer market. At $550, the new device is high-end, especially since it requires a console that retails for about the same price and expensive games. However, previews of the immersive gaming experience are tantalizing. 4. HTC HTC Vive headsets are the mainstream choice for professional gamers. In its early days, HTC manufactured flip phones, PDAs, smartphones, and tablets. Now, the company is best known for its VR hardware. Vive Pro 2 is a tethered headset that features 2448 by 2448 resolution per eye and a 120 degree field of view and carries backward compatibility with all existing HTC Vive and Steam VR compatible accessories and controllers. HTC's Cosmos is a standalone headset and features 90 Hz display with a 110 degree field of view and an overall resolution of 2880 by 1700. 5. Microsoft Microsoft HoloLens was a virtual reality headset that allowed users to interact with virtual items in the real environment. More of a prototype aimed at military and industrial markets, HoloLens AR elements were semi-opaque and the field of view was a dismal 30 degrees. Satya Nadella's statement during his keynote for Microsoft's Inspire stated that Microsoft would be pursuing a software-led approach. At MetaConnect 2021, Nadella also announced the upcoming availability of Windows 365 and Xbox Cloud Gaming for Quest platforms. While this is good news for the Quest users, this announcement could be interpreted as the end of HoloLens AR development. 6. Google Google is a major player in the field of XR and has been investing heavily in it for years. It's hard to get a read on Google, 
The company is notoriously clandestine, and leaks are rare. However, we do know that Google's Daydream platform was dismantled. Project Iris could set Google up against Meta and Apple in the coming headset wars. The Google Mixed Reality headset will likely be powered by a proprietary Google processor, possibly the Tensor, and will also likely run on a custom operating system. A launch in 2023 is somewhat optimistic as Google is in the early stages of development. However, the company has distributed a limited amount of prototypes under a very strict veil of secrecy. 7. Intel Intel was one of the earliest players in the ARVR space. With more than three decades of experience in this field, it's no surprise that Intel has a central role in shaping the modern landscape of XR technologies. In 2015, Intel launched the first RealSense depth camera and computer vision SDK for developers. In 2016, Intel introduced Project Alloy, an all-in-one mixed reality headset designed for developers and manufacturers to use with Windows PCs. In 2017, the company partnered with Microsoft to bring us one of the earliest mixed reality headsets. More recently, Intel has shifted away from the consumer market and is focused on components and processors for extended reality hardware. However, the company deserves a shout out for being one of the earliest adopters of this technology. 8. Alibaba Alibaba has announced its plans to launch a $5 billion fund dedicated to investments in emerging technology like XR, AI, and quantum computing over the next decade. Damo Academy is expected to be the first fund of its kind for Alibaba, which has previously focused on funding startups through its Alibaba Entrepreneur Fund. The move could help Alibaba bolster its product availability in areas like machine learning, which is already considered an important tool for tech companies trying to compete against one another. The investment will be made by Alibaba's financial service arm, Ant Financial, and its cloud computing division, Alibaba Cloud. This could have a huge implication for the company and China as a whole. 9. Samsung Samsung entered the mixed reality market in the early aughts and today has an extensive portfolio of XR products. Samsung 360-degree cameras capture photos and video footage from every angle that can be viewed in VR. One camera model even comes with built-in AI capability that help you automatically stitch together your images into a fully immersive experience. Zhang He Han, CEO of Samsung Electronics, hinted that the company might be working on a new virtual reality headset at the Mobile World Congress in 2022. Han said, the metaverse is the talk of the town, so we have to buckle down. 10. Qualcomm Qualcomm Snapdragon XR platform comes equipped with a 360-degree video playback capability that will feature instant replay, panoramic view, and virtual high definition. Boundless XR delivers an immersive mobile XR experience with hyper-realistic visuals through a robust combination of processing, 5G, and edge cloud processing. Qualcomm recently acquired Nuvia for $1.4 billion. Through the acquisition, Qualcomm will expand its Snapdragon technology and plans to incorporate Nuvia CPUs across next-generation XR laptops. Number 11. Meta Of course, we can't complete our list without mentioning Meta. As we all know, Mark Zuckerberg is leading the charge into mainstream XR adoption. In October 2021, Facebook changed its name to Meta and declared its investment of 10 billion US dollars in the Metaverse division. The new name reflects the growing ambitions of the big tech company beyond social media. Meta has claimed 90% of the XR headset market, and the future has been irrevocably changed by the massive show and faith in virtual futures. With this bold move, Meta became more than just a social network, it became an entire lifestyle brand and has since inspired many imitators. Slicer, question of the week. Are you as excited about the coming age of extended reality and artificial intelligence, or is it scary? Technological capabilities have expanded beyond anything we could have imagined. If you want to know what's happening in the metaverse, hit like and subscribe, and never miss an upload. Thanks again, Slicers. We'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.